Hi, welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy that you decided to come back to see me. It means the world to me. If this is your first time visiting my channel, welcome. I am your empath, earth angel, and I was sent by the Lord to deliver that message to all of my chosen ones all over the world. The world is changing. Can you feel it? Can you feel the shift in the atmosphere? Can you feel the shift in your family members? Can you feel the shift in your so-called friends, in your neighbors, people that you pass every day, people that you interact with at work? The world is becoming more evil by the day. We all go about our day. We all go about our week. Continuing on the same path, week to week, day to day. Attempting to live our lives like everything is normal. Things are changing. And the chosen ones are the main recipients that are able to see this change that is occurring right before our eyes. Now, if you remember the 80s, if you remember the 90s, if you remember the early 2000s, you will know times are extremely different. And of course, if you are from the 60s or the 70s, then you know that it's really different. Now, some may argue and say, you know, of course, you know, times are going to change. Of course, that's what happens over the years. But we are in an era where it's intensifying quicker than uh, past times. It's a different world. It's a completely different world. And it's so important, chosen ones, to live your life with your eyes open. And what I mean when I say that is to live your life knowing that the change is here. Live your life knowing that even though you get up every morning and you go to that business, you go to that job, you go to that party, you go to that wedding that you were invited to, Live your life every day knowing that even though you're operating in these ways, these human ways, that it's not the same world. We are tricked into believing that we are in the same world that we were in 10, 15 years ago. We are blinded by many things, processes. I've mentioned this before um, on a previous video. The processes that we have been um, instructed and really pushed into participating in 
are there to blind us so that we cannot really see what's going on. The music, the music that comes on the radio now, I don't even listen to the radio. I honestly, if you were to ask me like, what are the hottest songs out right now? I'm the wrong person to ask because I really don't know. I don't listen to the radio. I don't know what's what's out there. The subliminal messages that are in these songs now, my discernment can't take it. I literally have to turn off the radio. If I turn the radio on, I have to turn off the radio. There is a movie called They Live. I believe that's what it's called. They Live. If you have never seen this movie before, you have to watch it. This is an old um, old school movie. It's from the 80s. But it's a movie that depicts really... I I strongly believe what's going on right now in in the world. It's a movie about, you know, Americans and um, the world is changing. And middle class, you know, average middle class Americans, there's really, there was no such thing. You know, the middle class was disappearing and you, you consistently saw the middle class being pushed to the lower class, you know, um, into poverty. So people that you would have normally seen having, you know, a home or even an apartment are just living on land. You know, they're living in these huts. They've created villages. People in the community have come together to create villages that they literally live in. And these are villages that are built by, you know, just supplies that are found in the streets. Cardboard, you know, wood. You know, um, people in the community are coming together to make sure that each uh, everybody is fed. And the elite, The elites are the ones that are prospering. The elites are the ones that have all the money. And um, you just have to watch the movie. I'm not going to go into detail, but watch They Live because it also shows a group of aliens that have taken over the earth, but you cannot really see who these people really are until you put on a special pair of glasses then you're able to see that these are really aliens but these aliens are everywhere they have taken over the world chosen ones we are in a new world the old world has passed we have to stay aware we have to stay strong we have to we have to remain on the battlefield every day I pray when I wake up in the morning because first of all I pray you know I thank God for allowing me to wake up but I immediately go into prayer asking God to cover me for the day because I don't know what's going to come my way. But I know that as long as I have Jesus and as long as I have the Lord with me, walking with me, I know that I'll be able to conquer anything that comes my way. And the warfare has been so heavy in my life lately. It's been really, really heavy. But the only way that I have been able to battle the warfare is the fact that I get up in the morning and I pray. So chosen ones, gear up, 
prepare for the battlefield every day because it is a battlefield out here. There is no way, the times that we're living in, there is no way that you can just wake up in the morning, just get up and just go about your day. You have to ask for direction from the Lord. You have to, there's no other way. So I encourage all of you to ask the Lord to increase your discernment, ask the Lord to increase your strength, increase your faith. And when you get up in the morning, pray to God and ask him to direct you, ask him to protect you. For this battlefield that you are getting ready to enter because chosen ones, we are officially at war. We are officially at war. We are in a new world. The old world has passed. I really thank you so much for staying to the end of my video. I hope that my message did resonate with you. Now, if my message resonated with your spirit in particularly, subscribe to my channel. Why not? Life is way too short. Chosen ones, please remember that God does love you. No matter what you're going through, no matter what obstacles are coming up against you, no matter how hard it seems, God loves you. Jesus loves you. The Holy Spirit loves you. The universe loves you. Be kind to the universe, chosen ones, because the universe loves you. And chosen ones, your empath, earth angel, I do love you. I really hope that I see each and every one of you on my very next video.